My name is Maggie Kettler. I am an audiologist who works at the main campus as well as the Liberty Township campus. Um, I am here today to talk about the ABR testing, which is the test that we complete on young infants and children who are older who have additional disabilities or are unable to complete the standard testing. The ABR stands for the Auditory Brainstem Response. That means the response that we get back from the hearing nerve when we play sounds into the ear. The test is done without the response of the child um, where we are uh, able to detect exactly where their hearing is. The way it is done is we put a small electrode on the forehead and one behind each ear. Um, this test, when we put an earphone in the ear, is able to give us responses. We will check the child's hearing at a low pitch, a middle pitch, and a high pitch sound, and that will really help us um, understand what their hearing is. The child should be sleeping throughout the evaluation, so what we will do is we will have you bring your child in um, tired. We will let you feed the child at the beginning of the test and sit in a rocking chair and hold the child the whole time. Um, we will then start the test once the child is asleep. We place one electrode on the forehead and one behind each of the ears. These do not hurt at all and the child should sleep through the entire process. We will also put an earphone at the edge of each ear. That will allow us to play the sounds which will help us get the responses we are looking for. Um, the results that we're hoping to obtain with the ABR test are the actual determination of a child's hearing. We are hoping with this test to be able to determine if a child has normal hearing or has a hearing loss that needs to be treated. The ABR test will help us to determine if the hearing loss is something that needs to be treated by a primary care physician or an ear, nose, and throat doctor, or if it is something that needs to be treated with hearing aids or a cochlear implant. Your child may be referred to this test based on their newborn hearing screening. In the state of Ohio, every child receives a newborn hearing screening before they leave the birth hospital. This test is just a screening and lets us know if your child is at risk and needs further evaluation. It is important for us to know what every child hears. With this test, we are able to determine if a child has normal hearing or if there is treatment that is needed in order to maximize the child's potential.